What's going on guys, welcome back to another episode of Ghost Recon Wildlands. We are continuing on from last episode. So, what we did last episode was start the new area, which is this one here. We did a mission where we had to get some files off a Unidad server, and I thought that was going to be a lot harder than it was, but it was still a fun mission. So, this episode, we are continuing on from that with this mission. General Barrow's former aide is being held in an Unidad stockade. Break him out and find out what he can tell us about Barrow's current location. Yes, we're doing some prison break type breaking out. You better not roll this thing. I won't be rolling this thing. Maybe in Battlefield, but not in this. So, we got to break somebody out, which is going to be pretty cool. We are going to go in loud. Yeah, do the business like we normally do on this channel. So, I will skip over there with the magic of editing and a click. Alrighty, guys. So, yeah, the first attempt on this mission didn't go too well. <laughs> but we're back for a second attempt. So, I need something to get through the gate. And I believe you can only get through with, like, a Unidad uh, vehicle. Oh, shit, I just threw a grenade. Why are my controls working very well? Well, that's not going to make a noise. 10 out of 10 flipping, throwing a grenade there. I'm going to try and... This is Operation Point Steel Car. Got a tango. Spotting another tango. Target marked. Keep an eye on your background. Shit, he heard his buddy fall. Looks like they're feeling froggy. Okay, we're still all right. Right, we took out all the bodyguards. This thing is armoured as shit, so let's get in it. Right, Operation Steel Car has gone successfully stolen the car with no Unidad control because they are annoying. But anyway, let's get into the game. Ah, let us in, you piece of shit. Oh shit, just flip it, shoot, just shoot. Opening fire. Bitch. Oh shit. I just hit a flipping explosive thing. Incoming mortar fire. Oh shoot. Right, I think he's in the prison. We need to find this dude. This should be our guy. Let's see what he knows. Oh, hello, dude. What the fuck is we found him, here? people. He's in the prison. Hello, my friend. Yeah, let's just have a chat in the middle of all this mess. Why not? We're your best chance of stopping these motherfuckers. I'm looking for General Barrow. Mierda. I used to be on that pendejo staff. He came to my birthday party once, but he's a cocksucker now. Where do we find him? No sé. I don't know where he is. But he has a daughter, the only family that viejo has left. She's a government paper pusher in some speck of a village in Flor de Oro. What the hell name does she use? Ah, Erendira. Erendira Buendia. You can use her to get to General Baru. Gracias. Good luck. Thank you very much, sir. All right, we completed the mission. Are we not going to escort him out of here? Bowman. Okay, that's cool. That former Unidad captain told us that General Baru has a daughter who goes by the name Erendira Buendia. She's living in a village in Flor de Oro, working as a civil servant. I've got the activity working on it now. Get a hold of the daughter. We can use her to urge General Barrow to meet with us. She's a civilian bowman. We've got her cell phone. I'm sending you the data now. You'll be able to track her yourselves. Go get her, then get her father the general. Solid copy. Alrighty guys, so I didn't manage to make it out there safely. I sort of got trapped on a helipad. Sniper, get to cover, move! But we managed to do that mission, which has unlocked the, the boss, really, again. Again, the boss, so early on. Okay, so it's unlocked what seems to be the boss fight. We might do the, this mission before, I'm not 100% sure. So, I'm going to leave this video here. We managed to attack that base. I'm surprised we didn't have to escort him out, but, you know. If you've enjoyed it, let me know by leaving a like or comment. Subscribe if you're new. Have a fantastic day. Peace.